There are new developments tied to the Israel-Hamas war happening both in the Middle East and here at home. The Pentagon is now confirming it paused a shipment of bombs to Israel amid concerns over their potential use in Gaza. NBC's Raf Sanchez has more. President Biden sending a message. As Israel's military continues its operation in Rafah, a senior administration official saying the White House stepped in to pause a shipment of arms to Israel out of concern about the possible invasion. The shipment, which was delayed last week, included heavy weaponry, like 2,000-pound bombs. The U.S. worried those weapons would be used in Rafah, where over a million civilians are sheltering. The official saying Israel has still not addressed its concerns about a military operation there. We will continue to make clear that we oppose a major military operation in Rafah, make that clear then privately as well as publicly. The Rafah crossing from Egypt, a vital lifeline for humanitarian aid, remains shut. And Israeli strikes in the area continue. Residents sifting through rubble. They said this was a safe area, this man says. There is no safe place in Gaza. Where to go? Throw ourselves in the sea? Israel says Hamas is hiding among civilians in the area. But it's continuing negotiations for the release of hostages. As pressure grows inside Israel, the CIA director involved in the talks. Israel says the latest proposal agreed to by Hamas, which would involve a full withdrawal from Gaza, doesn't meet its security needs. But still considering a deal as tensions build over Rafah. That's Raf Sanchez reporting. And now